Welcome to Carcass City Misery and Arrow in Your Head Stadium. The only field in the NFL built on an ancient and sacred burial ground. <laughs> way to go, guys. Is that why they can never win a playoff game here, Grim? No, Bricks. It's why they have so many skeletons in the stand. They just keep rising out of the dirt during games. This game is going to be a wholesale slaughter. No discounts from the NFL. The team storm the field. The Midway Mutants battle. The Carcass City Creeps. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Hi everyone, Grim Blitzrow with you on NFL Game Day. Hey, uh, Bricks, do you smell something burning? Ah, thanks for reminding me. I left my rubber foot in the toast oven to warm it up. Last time I left it there too long, it came out like Saganaki. Oppa! Uh -huh. It's freezing in here. Hey, why don't you take a shampoo and ouzo, stick your head in the toast oven, that'll warm you up. And it's first and ten. Huh? Huh? Man, he shoveled his feet so well on that play. He should go to lost wages and deal cards. First down! And it's first and ten. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. And it's first and ten. And he breaks away. A nice run there for eight yards. Second down and two. And this guy's like a human cannonball. First down. Yeah, my next door neighbor was a human. He drowned in his pool. <laughs> First down and one. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey. And if you don't understand why refs are hated even more than kickers, <laughs> First, and the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. <laughs> First down and forever. And they've had enough. The offense jumps off sides and attacks the ref. First down in a mile. Oh, and you can bury that guy because he is dead. Oh, did you see what number he was? I gotta check it off my dead mutant bingo card. I only need one more. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. He refuses to go down. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. <laughs> and the offense has only two running backs left, and the defense is licking their lips. Uh, I think they want to hit those last two runners for this ice cream. And that 
it's a pick. And now the quarterback is cursing the... Ooh, that hit's going to shave a few days off his life. And that's a hell of a cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot three. And he picks up eight yards on a strong run. Oh, mama. Just call him Cap'n Crunch. Another one bites the dust. <laughs> in the NFL because he just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. Yeah, nobody likes to watch that happen to a ref. Yeah, you got that right, Brickhead. They'd rather be down there in the field doing it themselves. A lot more fun. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Second down in a very lot. Oh, hold everything. Look 
looks like there's a penalty on the play. Well, the offense is running low on running backs. They have only two left. They need to conserve those runners now and consider passing more. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Yuck! That was not a kick you put on the resume. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not young. And it's first and ten. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. The 30. He's at the 20. Someone better buy this guy dinner tonight because he just saved a touchdown with that tackle. The offense is down to their last running back. When he bites the dust, they can only pass. Yeah, well, at least they don't have to fluff it, man. That's right, but now the defense can focus on killing the receivers. And it's first and ten. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. this they're going for two and he runs it in for an easy two points the momentum in this game may be shifting oh, those are just my fouls hey thanks for sharing bricks The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. <laughs> Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo, Grim. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're going to hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn? Now, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. And it's first and ten. He should apply for the Mutant Volleyball League. Hey, yeah. Uh, don't give the fans any ideas. The commission already spends all day on Twitter shooting down rumors. Second down and ten. Quick pass picks up maybe two yards. Third down and eight. The receiver makes a grab for five yards. Now this should be a chip shot for the kicker. And it's good! You know, Grim, in this league where murder and bribery are cheered, it's good to be good, huh? I mean, can we all just... Not this shit again. Bricks, I'm stopping it right there. He sits up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. First and ten. Oh, look at this guy. And he's up. Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Oh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. Ooh. 
no one does this but a dog's car. The offense lost their last running back on the previous play. Next time the offense comes out in the field, they will have no running plays. That's the end of quarter one. Well, the good news is there's still time to make it a game. And there's still time to get a beer. And it's first and ten. like an old guy looking for a bathroom. First down. And it's first and ten. Well, he made the pass, but then a slap in the face by the defense. Oh, that's me in the hotel bar every night. Hey, your opening line needs work. Why? Really? What's a pretty girl like you doing here all by herself? Are you a hooker? Well, it's a fan. And he picks up maybe four on that play. Third down and six. They pick up three on a short pass. Any field goals over 40 yards are difficult. He's going to really have to boom this one. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Any mistakes here? Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. Straight through the uprights. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. A man from prison just came out of the field. That's the ref, idiot. Oh. Let's see what the penalty is. <laughs> the burn returner was killed on that play. The coach will replace him with another player. And it's first and ten. Looks like a pass, and it's bouncing right back to the QB. Oh, it's the sticky ball dirty trick. Ah, oh, pass the popcorn, Grim. Zoom in on his face, then his crotch. I want to see if he cries or pisses himself first. Second down, and ain't going to happen, partner. Now, I 
I've had it. I'm running out of excuses for this QB. You just, and that was a bone crusher right there, folks. <laughs> and it's first and ten. And that's how you run it, folks. Picks up eight there. Oh, my God! A man from prison just came out of the field! That's the ref, you idiot. Let's see what the penalty is. The offense is down to their last quarterback. If they lose him, they lose the game. First down and one. Kick it. In that order, Grim? The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. My turn on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chimp wearing a wig. First and ten. Much like my wedding night, there was a big explosion, but then everyone left disappointed. Yeah, everyone? You had more than two people in the room? Yeah, the guy filming and the clown. Somebody's got to make the balloon animals. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. So was that cheerleader. The ref that just called that penalty, he was convicted of marrying old ladies and stealing their savings. That sounds like a good job. He's right at home here, taking money from coaches, players, and fans. I even saw him swipe the money from the bathroom attendant. Yeah, who don't do that? Third down, and the QB is saying his prayers. <laughs> That ball just sliced through the defense like butter. I wish he, could. he broke free and has open field in front of him. And they're catching up. Jump, jump, do something. Somebody get that guy a beer because he just saved me a thousand bucks. And it's first and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. And he catches it for a touchdown! What a beautiful play! Yeah, it's all those power and green, like a high cool. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It's good. <laughs> Looks like they're lined up for an onside kick. Uh, I thought they were going to do some sort of chorus line. The four people on the planet who care about rules and kickoffs must be happy to see a flag down. I'm just happy to see anything after that laser pointer accident. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Luke Warm. And he's proud of that. Boom, dead and down. He just 
have sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger, because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message, because the messenger killed him. Ah, uh, going in circles! And it's first and ten. Second down in a lot. And the goal with the brain scrambler. And it's first and ten. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is... It looks like we've got a penalty here. First and ten. He could go all the way. Seriously, man, you think you'll go toe to toe with me? You get my grill, I'll ruin your world. Ruin it. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. And the two-minute warning sounds. Time to get a beer. Hey. Get me one, too. <laughs> and it's first and ten. more to say about this guy except maybe a eulogy. Ah, uh, well, he was a violent alcoholic, a terrible father, and uh, he did some nasty things to dogs. <clears throat> but, uh, I mean, he was a great ball player. Uh, you know, that's really what counts at the end of the day, right? And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five on... Ah, uh, come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> that's why I love this guy. And so are the fans. <laughs> We lost the bleeps, the sweeps, and most importantly, the carcass city creeps here at home. Everyone is dead, so the creeps forfeit. They battled hard, but still got their butts handed to them. Gross. I hope there weren't any orc butts involved. I kind of like orc butts, especially with some Deshaun mustard and a smoked pickle relish. Not bad slipping. Let's go down to the field and see what the game's MVP thinks of today's outcome. <laughs> Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Micro Heart Corporation. They get it right every up.